Earthquakes, the shaking force beneath our feet. What are earthquakes? Earthquakes are sudden, powerful shaking or vibrations of the Earth's surface that occur when energy stored in the Earth's crust is abruptly released. Imagine the Earth's outer shell as a giant puzzle made up of huge pieces called tectonic plates. These plates are always moving, but they don't glide smoothly. They grind, collide, or slip past one another. Over time, stress builds up along the edges where they meet. When the stress becomes greater than the strength of the surrounding rocks, the rocks break or shift suddenly. This abrupt release of energy creates seismic waves, which ripple outward through the Earth's crust and cause the ground to shake. That shaking, from mild tremors to catastrophic quakes, is what we call an earthquake. Earthquakes can be so small that only sensitive instruments detect them, or so massive that they level cities and reshape landscapes. They are a natural part of how our planet works, constantly redistributing stress and adjusting the surface of the Earth. Why do earthquakes happen? There are several reasons why earthquakes occur, and while tectonic movement is the main driver, it is not the only one. Tectonic plate movement. Earth's crust is divided into about a dozen major plates and many smaller ones. These plates float on the semi-fluid mantle beneath them, moving a few centimeters each year, about the same speed as fingernail growth. When two plates interact at their boundaries, stress accumulates. Eventually, this stress releases in the form of earthquakes. Fault lines. Faults are fractures or cracks in the Earth's crust where earthquakes are most likely to occur. These faults mark the boundaries where plates slide past, collide or pull apart. For example, the San Andreas Fault in California is a transform fault where the Pacific Plate and North American Plate grind against each other. Volcanic activity, earthquakes are also closely tied to volcanoes. As magma pushes its way upward beneath the Earth's surface, it forces rocks to crack and shift, producing seismic activity. Volcanic earthquakes are often precursors to eruptions. Human activity, induced earthquakes. Humans can unintentionally trigger earthquakes. Large-scale industrial activities such as fracking, hydraulic fracturing, construction of massive dams, deep mining, or even underground nuclear tests can alter the stress balance in the Earth's crust, leading to smaller but still significant quakes. Some of the biggest earthquakes in Earth's history Throughout history, earthquakes have left lasting scars on humanity, not only in the ground, but in memory, culture, and global economics. Valdivia earthquake, Chile, 1960. The most powerful earthquake ever recorded, with a magnitude of 9.5 comma struck southern Chile. Around 1,600 people died, and millions were left homeless. The quake triggered massive tsunamis that crossed the Pacific Ocean, striking Hawaii, Japan, and the Philippines. Entire towns along Chile's coast were destroyed, and the Earth's axis shifted slightly due to the immense energy released. Sumatra Andaman Earthquake, Indian Ocean, 2004. One of the deadliest disasters in modern history, this undersea quake measured between 9.1 and 9.3 in magnitude. It unleashed a colossal tsunami that struck 14 countries, killing nearly 230,000 people. Entire communities in Indonesia, Sri Lanka, India and Thailand were swept away and economic damage ran into the billions. Tohoku Earthquake, Japan, 2011. This magnitude 9.0 quake shook Japan's northeast coast. Nearly 20,000 people lost their lives, thousands went missing and millions were displaced. The earthquake triggered a massive tsunami that overwhelmed coastal defenses, flooding cities and towns. Most famously, it caused meltdowns at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant, creating a long-lasting environmental and energy crisis. With damages of around $235 billion, it remains the costliest natural disaster in recorded history. The Great Alaskan Earthquake, 1964. Measuring 9.2 comma, this quake struck Alaska's Prince William Sound. It lasted more than four minutes and caused the ground to shift by as much as 60 feet in some areas. While only 131 people died, the quake generated tsunamis that traveled as far as California and Hawaii, destroying ports and communities. Haiti Earthquake, 2010. Though smaller in magnitude, 7.0, the Haiti quake was devastating due to the country's vulnerable infrastructure. 
More than 220,000 people died, and Port-au-Prince was left in ruins. The quake caused billions in economic losses and left more than a million people homeless. This event underscored how human vulnerability and poverty can turn even a moderate quake into a catastrophe. Major earthquake faults around the world. Earthquakes cluster along certain regions where plate boundaries exist. Some of the most notorious fault zones include San Andreas Fault, California, USA, a long transform fault that frequently produces strong quakes, threatening Los Angeles, San Francisco, and surrounding regions. Ring of Fire, Pacific Ocean. This horseshoe-shaped zone encircles the Pacific Ocean and accounts for 90% of the world's earthquakes. It includes Japan, Indonesia, Alaska, and Chile. Himalayan Fault, India, Nepal. Created by the ongoing collision of the Indian Plate and Eurasian Plate, this zone produces devastating quakes in Nepal, northern India, and surrounding areas. North Anatolian Fault, Turkey. This east-west fault line has historically generated devastating quakes and poses a high risk to Istanbul, a city of over 15 million people. East African Rift. Here, the African continent is slowly splitting apart, producing rift valleys and increasing seismic activity that will eventually reshape Africa's geography. Where are upcoming earthquakes most likely? While exact predictions remain impossible, scientists identify high-risk zones by studying stress buildup, past patterns and seismic monitoring data. Some of the most at-risk regions today include California, San Andreas Fault, Experts warn that a big one exceeding magnitude 7.5 is inevitable, though the timing remains uncertain. Japan, Nankai Trough. This offshore fault could produce a massive quake and tsunami, potentially devastating southern Japan. Turkey, Istanbul region. Seismic pressure continues to build along the North Anatolian Fault, increasing the likelihood of a destructive quake near Istanbul. Indonesia, sitting at the convergence of multiple plates, it remains one of the world's most earthquake-prone regions. Himalayan region, constant pressure from the collision of the Indian and Eurasian plates means future catastrophic quakes are expected. New technology and AI for earthquake forecasting. Technology is transforming how humanity understands and prepares for earthquakes. Seismic sensor networks. Thousands of seismographs around the globe detect even the faintest tremors. These networks help scientists track patterns, locate epicenters, and monitor foreshocks, the smaller quakes that sometimes precede a larger event. Satellite monitoring. Satellites equipped with radar and GPS measure how the Earth's crust shifts and deforms. These movements, often just millimeters, provide clues about where stress is building. Earthquake early warning systems. Countries like Japan, Mexico, and the United States now operate systems that can provide several seconds and sometimes up to a minute, of warning before destructive shaking begins. These systems detect the faster, less damaging seismic waves, P waves, and use them to trigger alerts before the slower, destructive waves, S waves, arrive. Even a few seconds can allow trains to stop, factories to shut down, and people to take cover. Artificial intelligence in earthquake forecasting, AI is emerging as a game changer. By analyzing vast seismic data sets, machine learning models are identifying patterns too complex for humans to see. AI can detect foreshocks, analyze microquakes, and improve the accuracy of early warning alerts. In some regions, AI-powered mobile apps already deliver alerts to millions of users seconds before the shaking reaches them. Researchers are also using AI to combine geological, GPS, and historical quake data to map high-risk zones more accurately than ever before. Summary. Earthquakes are sudden and powerful releases of energy caused primarily by tectonic movements beneath our feet. Throughout history, some of the largest earthquakes have killed hundreds of thousands, displaced millions, and caused trillions of dollars in damage. Fault zones like the San Andreas, the Himalayas, and the Ring of Fire remain constant threats to human societies. While predicting the exact time and place of an earthquake is still impossible, advances in seismic monitoring, satellite technology, early warning systems, and artificial intelligence are giving us better tools than ever before. These innovations provide precious seconds to minutes of warning, 
enough to save lives and reduce losses in the face of nature's most unstoppable force.